Hey everyone, welcome in another video. So today she is going to make um, um, a cake, a whiskey cake. But they need to subscribe. Don't forget if it's not done yet to subscribe and like the video, even if you didn't see it yet, because it's going to be great. And it's in English. So put the subtitles on if you want. If you speak French or any other language. C'est vrai. And, 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 and share. And share. And we are doing what? Going back to basics. Yes. With a cake that can be used for cake design. Yes. <laughs> so let's get started. Started. <laughs> and you go away. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> you guys see what I have to put up with? So she was making fun of me for not like succeeding in making my intro. At times it can be hard. So I'm looking for my words. Bear in mind that English is not my first language. So she was right there laughing. So now she had a taste of her own medicine because she tried and she saw that it is not that easy. So now what I was trying to say is that I'm stepping, a, like I'm gonna take a step back to do all the basics, like at least a lot, cake wise, shortbreads, creams, ganache and all that, and make a specific playlist so that when I do a tutorial, you don't have to go through the whole recipe again. You can go into the, play the playlist and pinch whatever recipe suits you best. So what I will do is for every cake, I'm gonna to try to give you the characteristics, how they work well, and um, what is what they are good for. For instance, today, the cake we are going to make holds well the fridge, like the cold, because there is no butter in there. So since there is no butter, the temperature will not have an impact on it. It is still light because we're gonna beat the white. So what's gonna happen with all these videos? Make sure you watch and listen because I will try to give you some little hints like that as we go. So the recipes that I will be giving you all throughout are for a 20 centimeters mold. I'm gonna try to put you in the description box a unit converter because as you've seen I'm doing everything in milliliters and uh, in uh, grams and all that so I'm gonna put if you're not using these units I will find a link to put you in the description box we need five eggs and we will separate the yolks and the whites we also need 200 grams of flour and 180 grams of sugar a pinch of salt and 11 grams of baking powder, vanilla extract, 130 milliliters of orange juice and 130 milliliters of vegetable oil. Turn the oven on to preheat and now what we're going to do is beat the whites. We are going to mix all the solids together. So this is the flour with the baking powder now this is the salt and the sugar and we put it all together maybe don't do like me and take something slightly bigger and then we do the same with the liquids we mix them all together and also the vanilla extract and we beat everything now we add to that the solids so we have our whites we are going to incorporate them in the mix we want to be careful not to break them lot of air and we do not want to lose it so we put 
for the mixture the butter into a mold. Let me put the butter in. Now this goes in a preheated oven at 180 degrees per an hour, but check on your cake because I don't know your oven, so it will depend on the oven you have. Cake is ready. You see, I let it cool down. So don't cut a cake before it's totally cold, otherwise it's not gonna hold its shape really well. So mine is not totally cool, but I want to show you as a all right, you see, it's like so light, you can tell. So up, I'm gonna put that right now. So there you go, we are done for today. If you have any idea, let me know in the comment box of something you would like to see me do. So I'm gonna carry on like that. I will show you as many basics, of, as many basics possible so that you have all your recipes ready for any kind of tutorial I will do later on. So thank you for watching me. See you soon for a new video.